Maybe they're hanging out in that cave. Come to think of it. Eh. It will be something to do on our way back. So we go to Zenithar. Pop in that cave and be like, what is that? Unless this is the camp I remember. Right up here. There's some people. Oh, my memory is good. Yeah, these are the people. Hey, guys. I think we... Hey. Welcome, traveler. We're all so worried about the goblins, we may not be as hospitable as we should be. Mrs. Goblin should come in. Everything was going well. We had set up camp at Cropsford, and it looked like a beautiful spot. Then the goblins attacked. <gasps> Thank Ifra that Marissa was there. Without her, the goblins would have surely killed us all. Thanks, Ifra. It was my father's dream for us all to start a new life there. He spent everything he had to buy the land. Now it all seems to be ruined. Ruined? Who's your daddy? Barth Elganad is my father. I'm worried about him. I think it'll break his heart if we can't build Cropsford. Cropsford? My father hired her as a guide at an inn south of here. Good thing, too. She saved our lives and led us safely back here after the goblin attack. Oh, yes. All right. Stop. Hello, I hope. Uh, goblins. We had just set up at Cropsford when Marissa right, came running. If you ask Barthel, it's the garden spot of Tamriel. Just go away. He has a weird body shape. Well hey, met. You. Come, warm yourself by our fire. No. Follow the yellow road northwest from here. Blackwood isn't so bad. Why don't you? Good day. All right. Hey, buddy. Hello, my friend. It's northwest of here along the yellow road. You'll see some of... Watch out for them if you're heading north. We ran... My family and I are still trying to figure out what to do. Say, do you think you could help us? Yes. I had a good feeling about you, friend. You should talk to Marisa about the goblins. She's our guide and knows what needs to be done. All righty. Settlement. We plan to call it Cropsford. My daughter Kalia, her husband Aloys, and I came all the way from High Rock to start a new life here. We have a charter from the county. Everything done official and by the book. I'm sure now that they knew all along that the hand was in goblin territory. But no matter. Who cares if a few settlers get themselves killed? That's a morbid way of looking at it, but I agree Good with day. you, sir. Hey. Hey. What? what? Sassy. You've agreed to help them clear the goblins from Cropsford? That's great news. I already did. I've done some scouting around while we've been camped here. And it looks like Cropsford... The caves around here are infested with goblins. Uh. Normally, goblins stay close to their lairs and wouldn't be a huge problem. But two tribes are at war. And their war parties are... The two nearest are Timberscar Cave and Cracked Wood Cave. Here... I've marked them on your map. Uh -huh. Unfortunately, Cropsford is right in between them. And Goblin War. Goblins have their own reasons for doing things. Don't make sense to us, usually. But I've learned a lot about their ways over the years. Each tribe guards a head in its lair. Whose head, I don't know. A sacred tribal totem, or something like that. Anyway, if you want to rile up a goblin tribe, steal their tribal head. Which is often what a rival tribe does, just to prove they're tougher. I'd lay odds that the war between the two tribes is because of a stolen... So, to stop the war, all you need to do is sneak into Timberscar Cave, find the stolen tribal head, and return it to the Crackwood Cave Goblins. Or I could kill them all! Unless you want to do things the hard way. Well... You could always just fight your way into Crackwood Cave and kill their shaman. Every goblin tribe is led by a shaman. But kill the shaman, and the tribe will dissolve into confusion. Most likely end the war. I like it. So we will do that as... And don't underestimate the goblins. All right, They're all right. Dangerous than they look. So we'll do that as soon as we're done with this and the little shrine thing that we're looking for. Ooh. 
might be another thing to look into. Since I probably won't be coming back to this area for a while. Lots of adventures to be had here on West and Jess Games. Goodbye, rat. Rat. You are a terrible rat. You're a ratty rat. Alright, there's the thingy. I love how the music is all epic and battle-y, just because there's a rat. Alright, that was probably something bigger than a rat. I learned my button! Alright. Ooh, an alien well. Make a mountain knit and top foot. <laughs> That's what this place is. Make a mountain beat the fat and foot. Fight him. Fight him, horsey. Alright. Horsey doesn't want to fight. I will end the battle then. Alright, let's go into Make a minute time. And hope that there is a statue in here. The statues are fun! And so are necromancers! Hi! Look how they just run away, like, yep, no. Yep, he died. Come back here, you slime! Ow! That hurt. A little bit. You will necromance no more in my cave. Ruin thing. Okay, it's not even mine, but what do you want? What do you want, man? Ooh, summer bullet cap. It's not worth anything to me, but cool. <gasps> oh, dude! Barla stones by the bullying. Oh! Cool. Where's the other button? I need to find another button. This alone is worth the trip. Four thousand gold worth the cardless stuff. Alright. Hey, hey! Ah! <coughs> missed! Okay, maybe it didn't. Oh! Ow! Stop it! Very mean skeleton. Oh no. I hope that killed whatever triggered it. Nope, almost. Yeah, there you go. Twat by his own twat. Sorry, keep going to the map. The map. There's another Dora song for you. I'm the map! Gotta go to three miscellaneous places. Oh, you could probably open that somehow. Me no no. We and I'm gonna jump around that. Okay, that was close. Too close, in fact. I have an app for that. Wow, this is a really good app. Uh, that's a little heavy, but I can take it. Tomb of the Undead. Well, well, look who we've got here. You're a dead necromancer. Two dead necromancers. That's what we got. Eerily similar faces and voices. What a cookie dink! I didn't even see him for a second. Where'd he go? Well, I would definitely describe this as a tomb of the undead. They get bonus points for accuracy. Put that away! 
Lose ya, dude. Ooh, Novix, Novice Island deck. I wasn't already way down, I'd totally take that. Even though this character is not built for alchemy in any way, shape, or form. Alright. So, this is the up and up. That should activate the stairs and do nothing else. Right. Yes, good. Everything good. Uh, that's. Whatever it was, it's gone now. Whatever it was, it was just a giant orc stomping around. Come here, you son of a gun. A little fire, scarecrow! Come back! Hey, you! You suck! That's why I say to people on Jeopardy, you don't do a truly daily double, you just tell them they suck. What about to say, lady? If you went there, I would not forgive you. What is that? Oh, it's their asylum. It's not Arkham Asylum. Oh, that'd be a fun game to let's play. I do own it. Put a comment on this web zone if you think Arkham Asylum would be a cool idea. And that was completely random. But anyway, I do not see a statue yet, so we move on. Hopefully they have a statue in the asylum. I hope the statue is of a man. With... The, I, I forgot my joke. It was from Freakazoid. Ah, that was it. More useless than a man. With two apples for feet. I always thought to myself, you know what? That is pretty useless. Go back. Aha! Clever points to me. Unclever points to this poor slob. Go, go, yeah! Oh, he blocked. Go back. Go back, Mr. Sony. Go back. Aw. That would have been cool. Oh, well. Alright, here's some Wickley Land stones and a man who looks very intimidating in the back. I'm gonna need some of this. Probably some of that wine if it wasn't worth so much. Alright, go. There it is. Alright, there's the Lord High Inquisitor here. Alright. Hopefully I can just take her down a couple swings. Yes, I did. Hi, zombie! Your reign of terror ends now! Someone ripped out this poor zombie's crotch! Is this zombie gonna have any fun now? Poor zombie. Crotch's life is not one to be lived lightly. Alright, so play more of Sparks. I don't need that. Yeah, throw that in there. I don't really need the Claymore Sparks either. I think one super awesome enchanted weapon is good enough for me. That I will sell and celebrate the selling of by tweeting it. Not really. Because that sounds stupid, but. Speaking of sounding stupid, listen to this. <laughs> I don't know where that came from. I don't know where a lot of my material comes from. It just comes, comes from the vacant lot of my mind. There we go. I knew doing it twice would be a good idea. Ah, satisfaction. It was guaranteed to me by the people who made this game, I guess. 